What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jonathan the Game Duel here. Welcome you back to another crazy episode of the Pokemon White 2 Randomized Stuff Lock. <sighs> it's, it's right now, it's about 10.30, and we're gonna, like I said, my goal is to try and finish this lock. And what I mean by finish this lock is get to the finale so that I can solidify a date for the finale. And I'm crossing my fingers that we got a good got a good one going on for you today. Um, we have the team, and we're going to fight Getsis. That's our very first battle, is a scary battle against Getsis. But we're going to go ahead and show you guys the team. All we're working on is with full restores, which is not bad. But we got Thames at level 61 with Magma, St Mag Magma Storm, Extreme Speed, Sacred Fire, and Bolt Strike. We've got Kepson with Venoshock, Rolling Kick, Coil, and Fire Punch. We got Kevin with Night Slash, Water Spout, Surf, and Pedal Dance. We've got Beegers with Silver Wind Workup, Heal Order, and Extra Sensory. It feels weird because there's like no game audio. We've got Joy with Skull Bash, Blizzard, Haze, and Water Pulse. And we got Deadmon that we can't use. So that's the team right now because we literally still have not been able to find access to a PC. So hopefully we can get access to a PC very soon but we will not know wow i did that immediately that's oh nope i did not oh yes i did ha 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 i'm actually proud that i did that like instantaneously that's probably really easy and i did it instantaneously because it's easy but that is besides the point because it's a whatever scenario. But yeah, we have Getsis that we have to fight. And trust me, I am a little nerve-wracked as this is still considered the giant chasm. Okay. But with this still being considered the giant chasm, I cannot get an encounter. Sadly, Anorith wouldn't have mattered anyway. It's level 47. That tells you. And I didn't even buff the wild encounter. So that tells you that this area is normally pretty high-leveled. Um, but we're also getting basically to the end here. The giant chasm. This is the spot where Kiram's power resonates. Here, Kiram can use the full extent of its power and easily cover all of Unova in ice. Kiram, come. I have a memory that has continued to haunt me. Just one. That unpleasant look in your eyes reminds me of it. That aside, this is my gift to you. To show my respect for making it this far, I will freeze you solid right here so you can watch my glorious ascent. I feel like it, I feel like the other two legendary mons come and save me for something. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> I thought that was going to happen. That was a Reshiram, right? So you came. The freak without a human heart and... I knew that was happening. I was like, I thought that somebody came in and stopped you. Reshiram told me that Kiram is suffering. I can't allow selfish humans to make Pokemon suffer. And I like you, Nova. It's the place that taught me how to live as a human. It's the place that made me notice the harmony between Pokemon and humans living together. I will protect the Pokemon and humans who live here. Excellent. That was a moving expression of your determination. So the education I provided to make you a king wasn't com a complete waste then. But I still haven't forgotten that even though I was kind enough to find you when you were living in the forest with Pokemon and took you in and cared for you, in the end you were selfish and disrupted my plans. I was supposed to use your abilities to rule Yanova. But I'll forgive you for that as well, Reshiram. When you were c kind enough to bring it with you, you can melt ice. Now you've saved me the work of searching for it. Well, actually, I knew you'd appear when, I fi when we fired ice missiles into Opelousa City, and you noticed the change. 
That was an ugly formula. It won't work. Oh, but it will if I use these. The DNA splicers. Oh, no. Oh, we have to, do we have to fight a Kiram White? Because my team cannot handle a Kiram White right now, not gonna lie. I think we actually have to handle the Kiram White. Um. Uh oh. Oh God, we 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 do. We have to handle Kiram White. We have to handle Kiram White. We have to handle Kiram White. Oh no! 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 That's not what I wanted. No! 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 No, 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 no. We don't have a team to handle a Kieran White. Uh, plus, it has randomized moves, so it can literally ball out with a move that can destroy the entire team. Um... Kiram, absorb Reshiram. Use Absofusion. That's not even a real move, but okay. It doesn't let me skip the cutscenes, so we're gonna have fun um, watching cutscenes apparently today. Um. These cutscenes are so good. Oh boy. Like I said, we are not ready for this. We have Thames in the lead. It's a dragon. It's still a dragon ice type. It didn't change typing. I would have never believed that Pokemon could fuse together. That there was a formula like it. This. You fool. Last time I was going to use you to capture people's hearts and minds to rule them. But this time, I'm simply going to use your overwhelming power and rule with an iron fist. Do you understand that if you had simply become king, you never would have remained beautiful? Come now, trainer. This time, I will save you. But, to make things interesting, I'll give you a chance. Let's see if you can stop this, Kiram. What's this? Your Pokeballs are trembling. Could it, your Pokemon be shaking with rage? No, that's not possible. Simple tools don't have emotion or thought. Come, challenge Kiram. Just so you know, catching it is impossible. My cane and its signals that this rub to the function of all the Pokeballs. Okay, well, good to know that we can't catch it. So this is a legendary we can't catch. Will it actually be Kiram Black or will it be a, oh God. We actually don't have to deal with Kiram Black. Now, we kind of have to deal with something that's ultimately worse than Kieran Black, because we literally can't handle psychic types. But I guess that's not a bad thing. I honestly think we would have been able to handle Kieran Black a little bit better than an Azelf, especially because this is an attacking Pokemon. But it is randomized, preferring same type. There's not very many good psychic moves, so having a psychic type is that's not going to be that bad. I think Beegers can handle this. I kind of am sad that it's not a Kiram White. Not gonna lie, but again, ooh, something, yes. Okay, see, oh, frick. That's not what I was hoping for. Okay, well, I need to use an ether. 
that's unfortunate. <laughs> okay, Synchronize is 120 base power, but it only works on Psychic Pokemon. That does 20 damage. We're good. We are, we are absolutely okay. Like, it is not a defensive Mon whatsoever. Oh, Ally Switch? Really? This has a terrible bad moveset. Look at that. See, not... And we got the boost. We won. Wow. Not gonna lie, I'm very happy with the way that went. I'm gonna get the mic a little closer to me. I am definitely very happy with the way that went, because that's it. Because it was... What was I freaking out about? Literally nothing. I mean, I, again, I didn't know it was going to not be randomized, so I thought it was going to whip out something. But seeing a psychic type was probably our best, the best thing to see. But again, it also proves that I need a dark type on the team. <laughs> it actually played the Oz Elf sound effect. That's hilarious. I was not expecting that. Not gonna lie. I thought it was not gonna play that sound effect, but it did. White, the white Kirin went to all the trouble of preparing. How irritating. And now I've got to recapture Kirin, don't I? But first, I'm gonna take down this disgusting trainer with my own hands. And this time, I will succeed no matter what they try. No one will be able to stop me. And theme is gone. This is definitely not end, but it's gets this. Let's go. Dude, I love the Gustav theme so much. You have six mons. Okay, you're going to have like a level 60 something ace, which is going to be a little scary, but we're going to handle it and we're going to do just fine. You led with a alligator, which means we can fusion bolt the crap out of this thing. Dude, I'm so glad I started getting the audio to work the way I needed it to. Oh, we're leading with an Aqua Tail. Oh, that's a cr Oh, my God. Dude, that is literally the, the first turn. Are you kidding me? This is how we're going to start this battle. The first turn, we're going to get a crit. Okay, Gatsis, I see what you're doing, and I don't appreciate it. Not at all. Dude, what a first turn. He gets a crit and lives on one. Favorite first turn of all the battles. And I'm going to have to heal, and he's going to heal. So... Again, we can we can live with it, but that's a little unfortunate. But I know he's gonna heal too. So like, again, basically turn one got reversed. Um, and he shouldn't crit me twice in a row, right? Like, there's no way that he crits me twice in a row. Like, right? I mean, we could miss Fusion Bolt though, because I'm John, and I would naturally miss it the one turn, and he'll crit probably again. If he crits again, I'm gonna be mad. Okay, no crit. And we hit, if we crit back right now, that'd be just splendid. But I don't think we will. I think he'll get into the red. I just realized he was holding the leftovers. He's not healing again, right? There's no way. Okay, I figured. And a crit won't kill, because a crit we already determined as 140. Dude, this... Elite Four is going to tear me to pieces. Because they're going to be level 68. We... The rolls are going to be massive. I am, like... I'm shaking in my boots right now. Like, I don't know if you can see that. You probably can't. But I am literally shaking. Oh my god. Holy shit. I am so freaking nervous. It's not even funny. Holy crap. That should kill, right? You're a whale lord. Okay, thank god you killed. Like, if this is anything that the Elite Four is going to be, which I know it's going to be just that much harder, I'm actually genuinely nervous. Um, That's an Amaral, though, and we can't handle Amaral very well. Crap. No, 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 no. Like, I think a lot of this nervousness derives upon the fact that, like, we don't necessarily have the best of team. It's a sur it's a survivable team, but it's not really a great one. Oh god, um, Armado's gonna kill Joy with a Rock type move. Thames can come in, but Thames is not super effective. Kevin can come in and be super effective, but not right now because he's locked into Pedal Dance. Oh my god, like. If I was ever 
well, I'm in the service right now, but, like, I have never... I think a lot of it, too, is I've never beaten White 2 before. Like, the furthest I've gotten is to the Victory Road, where I lost to a Frenzy Planting thing. So, like, it was a Frenzy Planting shift tree, because it killed my Marowak. Um, ooh, I'm so glad I stayed, or I moved out, but, like, or moved out of the Pokemon. Um, Sacred Sword's not even going to do that much. It's going to do, like, half. Because that's neutral. It's neutral, but it's not even half. No. Uh, not even half? Like, that's bad. Uh, and, well, wow. That, that was, oh, my God. I low rolled. I just realized that. I low rolled because I did the same amount of damage. So I low rolled on the important one, but high rolled on the non important one. Because I'm John, and I have to low roll on the most important turns. Because um, it would not have mattered if I would have high rolled on the other one, but low rolled on the defense. Ugh. Um, do oh, sh Again, we can't handle Dodrio very well. So seeing it is not in my best interest. Check moves. Do I have Blizzard? I do have Blizzards. Okay. Joy, get out here, please. Um. I'm just happy that Joy has been, like, I was a little hesitant about Wall Rain. Obviously, it's, like, my least favorite Pokemon. But it's 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 moving up in the ranks. It's proving its point. It's doing what it needed to do. And so having it on my side has been just, it's been beautiful. It really has been because it's been reliable. Oh, my God. Why did that do so much damage? It had, it had Life Orb. Oh, my God. It did not just have life orb. Dude, that had a life orb. Why did that have an item? Why did Getsus have an item? Does Getsus have items on all his Pokemon? And I just didn't realize that until now. Eli Mize, we can hit. We don't have a rock type. We don't have a fire type. Oh my god. We literally can't handle Eli Mize. Uh, it's super effective, I guess. Joy, you're going to have to stay in, but you're going to have to heal first. Because I feel like you can... You can take hits from Ely Mize, right? Like, there's no way that you cannot take a hit from an Ely Mize. It's an Ely Mize. Please. Struggle Bug. That's gonna re that's gonna lower my special attack, though. Okay, that was a crit, which means we know that you know you don't do anything, because you would have done double that. Good play on the Ely Mize's part to detect. That was a great play on its part. But again, here Joy is hitting these blizzards, doing exactly what it needed. Wow. Wait. Oh, shoot. It's a pure bug type. It is literally a pure bug type. I didn't realize that. Okay. Well, with it being a pure bug type, I guess. Oh, no. You could, you could scan with heal order. No. <sighs> oh, no. Why can you spam with heal order? Uh oh. Ely Mesa is going to cause us some issues. I don't want it to, but it's going to. Struggle bug. It's going to lower my special, which is fine because I want to coil up anyway. Um. Mm. Let's go. We coiled on the detect. Okay, so a plus one attack, defense, and accuracy. So, fire punch should do... What? It literally just saved that. No, if you go into a Psychic-type Pokemon, I'm going to be mad. Scolipede. Oh, that's fine. That's bug as well. It probably has something for me, though, if, you're gonna, if you chose to U-turn into it. So, you better kill it, please. It's your plus one. You didn't kill it. Uh-oh. Okay, pound was your best move. We're fine. Um, and Elimay is coming back out, which will die. Um, of course, you're going to detect stall because you want to just make the video go longer and longer and longer and longer. 
Double protect. Double protect. Don't hit the triple protect. Good, you, you turned. I cannot believe you hit the double protect, though. That was a one in six. Like, literally, the chances were less than 15% for him to do that. Like, to hit it, and he did, naturally. So he stalled an extra turn. Oh, wow. Did we get a lot of money for winning these battles, though. I'm not gonna lie. How could this be? I am the creator of Team Plasma. I am perfect. I am an absolute ruler who will change the world. And I have a loss to some unknown trainer. Not once, but twice. I cannot accept this. This is impossible. I can't be bested by fools who can't even use Pokemon correctly. It's hard to call you this. Father, please understand. Pokemon are not tools. Pokemon are humans. And Pokemon and humans take each other to the greatest heights. They are wonderful. Some humans understand this. Why can't you? Shut your mouth. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Blah, blah, blah. Don't talk to me like that. Um, Lord Getsus has lost control. We will take it from here. Okay, without father, Team Plasma is farewell. D wait. On behalf of everyone, thank you. Kierm is fine. Now it has lost its power, but it'll come again. That's right. I can talk with your Pokemon. On that day, two years ago, a certain trainer in Alder taught me something. May. Uh, by accepting different ideas, this world creates a chemical reaction. So it met. So I met many different people and people Pokemon and heard so much. And that's how my world quietly grew bigger. By being with Pokemon, humans can continue towards new horizons. Just like you. If you hit 1,000 subscribers, that'll add to your true power. That's what Reshram taught me. Reshram taught me to hit the subscribe button. And somebody, someday, both truth and ideals will come together. Then po Pokemon and humans will be free from the oppression of YouTube. You. What are you striving for? A thousand subscribers. But before you hit a thousand subscribers, you should go to the Pokemon League and put your true test, true strengths to the test. Oh my God, we are actually going to the Pokemon League. Oh God, I cannot believe that that's literally. Team Plasma ships through away. It is over. I see. It is finally over now. More importantly, you rescued Kieran from Team Plasma, right? You are really something. I'm gonna make sure Perlin gets back to my sister. Still can't take it out of the Pokeball yet, though. What are you gonna do? He said go to the Pokemon League? That's an amazing idea! I mean, now you're the strongest you know of, right? Go prove it! Do you remember where we first met up at the Giant Chasm? If you follow the path from there, it goes down to Route 23. Victory Road and the Pokemon League are just past there. Wait, huh? Wait, can I take his staff? Oh, nope, we can't take his staff. <laughs> So, it said something about going to Route 23, like where we met. I don't remember or recall this at all. Where did you meet? Where did we meet at the Giant Chasm? Like, I'm not gonna lie, I don't actually remember. Um, okay, so we met at the Giant Route 23 is, like, do you remember where we met at the Giant Chasm? It leads you straight to Route 23. Do I need strength? Because if I can just go to straight to Victory Road, why not, right? Like, I don't know. I'm just debating. I'm thinking. Um, where did we meet? Because, sorry, I'm trying to go based off of what I remember. Um, we met right here. So is he saying to the right? No. If you go up and to the right, maybe. I might be completely off, but like. This feels like it's the right way to go. Oh, yeah. I see, because it leads to Route 23. Yeah. Okay, 
I was right. Okay, we'll take we'll take being right. So we are on Route 23. We can get an encounter here as well. Um, oh god, this is so scary. But yeah, we're gonna actually get to Victory Road and end off there. Because that just seems like a perfect place at oh, There it is! There's our first level 60 Pokemon! I knew we were gonna see it soon. I'm so glad that we have a 100% accurate move. Because, holy cow, that would have been scary, but we literally can take it. But it is, that is something, if something, we need to lead with uh, Thames if we run into that kind of stuff. Like, I'm glad we've been leading with Thames, because if we weren't, we'd have more issues arising. Dang, I was, I literally failed, I went back and up to go through the rocks, and I still failed miserably at doing that. Whew. How long is Victory Road? Is it long? I don't know. Like, it's that is very weird not knowing that how long Victory Road actually is because I've literally never, like, oof, very, very wor under overworldly scary. Um, okay, one thing is for sure though, we need to go into Beegers, and then after that, we have the Victory Road episode, and then I can end it. And then I, so yeah, it is looking like this Sunday is the finale. <sighs> God. This is like, ha ah, It's aha moments for me. Because if the finale episode is on Sunday, April 12th, which is looking like it's going to be, okay, and we can, Joy can go out. Like I said, I want, so, okay, so if the Elite Four is what I, what it says. It's going to be level 68. So I want to train up to level 67 or 66 because the ace is 68. So if I want, if everybody's level 66, then it'll give me time to work up. I'll see what the aces are and train accordingly. But because you literally don't get to, you get to pick they're like they've got those like same levels everybody does so holy cow okay Plusle. oh 58 Brian, weird. Okay, that's fine. We can live with Brian. We really can. Um, that should kill, right? Yeah, that's what I assumed. But again, we don't have a ground type. Oof, we gotta get a sixth member on the team. That is a for sure thing. So once we can, we will. Um, but we won't really use it to the elite four. So like. That's fine. Like, we can use it as Death Fodder in Victory Road, but in the Elite Four, like, actually use it, use it. What I'm thinking, Purloin. Purloin kind of seems like that just weird but interesting Mon to add on the team. I know we have a Regirock Rock in this back. Force Palm, keep old moves. I know that we have Magma Storm, and Magma Storm is terrible for Hariyama, but still. I don't know which way is the right way to go, um, but mm, at least we're fighting all these like ace trainers and people. Leveny, we don't have anything for you, do we? No, we don't. Oh wait, we have Magma Storm. <laughs> See, this is why we have Magma Storm. It's for this exact reason right here. Um. Okay, good. We hit it. Now, the real question is, is will this Oko? It's quad effective. Nope. Oh, yep, because it's gonna do the residual damage. Huntail. Kevin, get out here. <laughs> I guess we could have stayed in, but Kevin's gonna be just the better option again. Because we know this Huntail does not have anything for Kevin, so. I mean, it could actually now, because we don't know what it is. Passable 30 something, but that's okay. 
Um, uh, Pedal Dance is going to just demolish the crap out of everything, and goodbye, Hotel. Jeez, oh, all these level 60s. It's like, it's literally stunning me that I'm seeing level 60s, but it really shouldn't be because I was, I was ready for it all along. Oh, wait. There's an item here. Full incense. Okay, $4,800. That's enough for... That's enough for some stuff. Dang it. I messed that up. Okay, yeah. Up there is Victory Road. <laughs> Jesus, this is like... This is not okay, guys. Like, this is too much. Too scary for the given moment. Um, I'm going to go ahead and hit you with a bulk strike. Because we know Pound's not going to do anything. And bulk strike should do a lot. Oh, we got the para too. Nice. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and e-speed, even though we got the pair out. It's just, it's the safer bet, and it should still kill. Yeah. Okay. Next mon coming out is a Tentacruel. Which Thames will stay out for. And Thames will Bolt Strike this thing. But before we Bolt Strike, we're gonna heal up. Make the safe play. I really hope that whatever attack it hits me with does less than 115, but... Oh. Oh, boy. Wow. That literally... I made the right call there. Because that literally did 100. And 17 damage. And I was slower. Oh, thank God I made the right call. Like, I could have easily made the wrong call there, but I made the right call. Like, I am very happy with myself on that one. I'm so, I laughed, though, because that's another per, kind of a perfect roll that I was predicting. Okay, that's Victory Road for sure. Like, we're here. This is it, right? This has to be it. Oh, yeah, there's N. Yep, this is it. Okay. You came. The Pokemon League is just past Victory Road. The more battles do nothing more that... Uh, Pokemon battles do nothing the more that Pokemon. That's how I understood it. But it's not that simple. Pokemon battles decide winners and losers. It's true. Yes, they do much more. Your Pokemon, you, your opponents, and their Pokemon. Everyone can see wonderful things that others contribute that's right. Accepting different ideas, different beings, changes the world like a chemical reaction. Pokemon battles are just the catalyst, a small component that leads to big changes. My friend Reshiram Ram taught me that, and it's the formula that I've derived for traveling the world. I want you to think for yourself about what that means. Here, take this with you. The new Victory Road has areas that are only accessible with waterfall. Oh no, we do we. So does that mean that we need waterfall? Like that feels like we need waterfall. Yes. If it's your Pokemon and you, you will get past the leagues and recognize your own truth. That's what I see in store for you. Okay, like I said, to me, that means that we need Waterfall. Yeah, this is new. I have not seen this. Oh, boy. We are now past the point that I've ever gotten. I think. Because I don't remember that. Oh no, I do. I remember this. Okay, never mind. I do remember this. 
Oh yeah, no, for sure. Because there's like tunnely parts in here too. And there's, yeah, the Pokemon Center right here. Yeah, no, I do remember this. I don't remember, okay. Oh, we actually are here, okay. Now it's the time to pick who we're adding to the team. Yeah, because this is, because this is the area that I actually grabbed some of my um, Sackmons trying to get through this area. Because we had a level 63 Marowak that was carrying the team. But we do get to deposit our dead. And we get to withdraw a new Mon that we're gonna add to the team. And out of these Mons, to me, awkwardly enough, the best bet is going to be Purloin. Because, well, Purloin's moose that's trash, though. Shaman might be good. Because that's a grass type. What does that help us with? Electric, which we struggle with mightily right now. But it also gives us more flying weaknesses and we don't have anything for it either psychic still gives us an issue currently and purloin would actually mask that completely i'm gonna do it purloin is gonna be added to the team it will not be trained up until the elite four it will be used as a sack mod but it is something that can come in <coughs> and in the final episode of the pokemon white two or i say final but it's not necessary the final recorded episode of the pokemon white two randomizer nuzlocke you will see tomorrow saturday april 11th 2020 noon pacific standard time oh my god wild that we're already here but we indeed are i appreciate you guys all joining me in this journey and again we'll see you tomorrow at noon for the finale or for the final recorded series or final recorded episode of this series peace out y'all <laughs>